guess what showed up today? Exactly where I wanted it to be, but where I had checked a million times and it never was. My phone! No, I didn't leave it at school. No, it wasn't in the lost property. No, I didn't leave it on the bus. No, it hadn't fallen down the side of the couch. It was sitting on my bedside table. Isn't that just life, though, that just at the point when you've given up hope of ever finding it again, it pops up? Just at the point when you tell your cousin that you're thinking you're going to have to buy a new phone, there it is in plain view. Honestly. Good old phone. You don't need to be replaced. I don't know, I mean, I only lost my phone for a small amount of time in the grand scheme of things, but yet I felt so disconnected without it, and it just... Okay, B, stop what you're doing. Cut. I have something really, really important to tell you. Uh, okay. Okay. Hi. Um, Ursula and Hero are downstairs right now talking about you. What are they saying? I, I mean, it's not that nice, but you kind of have to see it or hear it. Okay, okay. Follow um, me. Alright, I will disconnect and I am following you. Okay, come on. So, what were you saying about Benedict? Oh, Benedict? You must have heard wrong. No. I know, it's... Wait, what's going on? I mean, I know that he's really upset, and I think I saw him crying the other day. It was really weird. Yeah, well, to be honest, I'm not surprised. The poor guy who locks himself in his bedroom all the time. He hardly eats or he sleeps. It's really sad. Yeah, the poetry he's been writing. Poetry. What? Yeah. Wow, I... Wow, what? That's... Okay, yeah. two things. Yes. One, I'm not surprised because Beatrice is really, really great. Yeah, she's great. She's great. Two, what are you going to do about it? Okay. Pedro and Claude told me to tell her, but I don't think it's a good idea. Why? But don't you think he deserves to be with her? I, I definitely think he deserves to be happy, and I think that they'd be great together. Hmm. But Beatrice is too proud, and even if she did like him, she'd never admit it. You know, I honestly think that she's too busy being in love with herself to, um... She's too busy being in love with herself to have an eye for anyone else, and... I mean, I'm pretty sure she gave herself a card on Valentine's Day last year. Okay, no, yeah, you're right. If she did know about this film, she'd tease him with it. She would. She'd absolutely tear him apart. And yeah. I don't think he'd be able to handle it. I mean, she picks flaws in every single decent guy out there. Like, if we see a hot guy, she'll find something wrong with him. If he's pretty, he must be gay. If he's tall, he's a gangly giraffe. If he's short, he's a garden gnome. Oh, and if they talk too much, then she hates it, which is hypocritical. Yeah. And if they don't talk enough, she hates it even more. <laughs> but she is really amazing. So she is. the guy that she needs to be with should be the same as her. Yeah, which I think, I think is Benedict. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I think it's amazing. And I'm, I'm sure you guys will agree with me on this, that he's like, without a doubt, pretty much the hottest guy at our school. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh, of course, apart from Claudio. Oh, yeah. yeah. And, <laughs> and Robbie. Uh, but yeah, mm -hmm. anyway, Benedict adores her and he thinks that she's so perfect, so I don't know, we have to do something so it's less hard on him. Yeah. But what? I don't know, I suppose we could tell him a whole lot of really embarrassing things about her so he no. sees some of her flaws. No, that's... You, you couldn't do that to her. Well, I can't tell him that...
It it's is. kind of the way you suffer through this heartbreak or, yes. you know, telling Beatrice and then him just falling apart with all of her teasing. Exactly. So I, I think I'll just them. tell Claudio to tell him that it's never, ever, ever, ever going to happen. Well, if it has to be done. I'm actually quite thirsty. Yeah. Um, yeah, do you want to head into the kitchen, get a drink maybe? Going, yes, into yeah. the kitchen.